we're back with another video and uh today i'll be showing you guys how to make these cool dart guns and they fire pretty well and just to show you that i will stand right here and uh and just like that it'll work so uh and uh see so you can see it fires it's very easy to make, and uh, let's get right into it. So finally today, we won't be needing that much resources. You can literally make it out of any scrap you have. Uh, I have a ton of stuff left over from the last few videos of me making those annoying squares. So uh, I still have this. I still have uh, this. I still have this, and I still have this, so uh, we can get started. I'm just going to make a tiny one, because, like, as you can see, this one's not that big at all, and the dart to go along with it is not that big either, so you can bring this anywhere you want. Just put it in your pocket, and it'll work, and uh, I also have this bigger one that's, like, this size, and uh, the dart inside is bigger. So, yeah, uh, let's start. So, um, you can make it out of any size you want, out of any piece of paper you want. It doesn't have to be that big, but, um, what I find really, really easy to do is take these already turned into squared notepads or jot notes, and, uh, as you can see, they'll It'll be a bit sticky on one side, so we can use this to our advantage to just straight up roll one and you won't even need tape. But if you don't have these, then tape is another option. And uh, these things do not stick that well, but they will work. But um, since I'm already doing this video, I'm going to make one out of plain piece of paper. So. If you're not sure how big it's supposed to be, you can take a random pencil, just go like that, and uh, once you have that, you can just roll it up. And uh, once you have it rolled up, get some tape. You do not need this much. I did a bit too much, but... Uh, I think it'll be fine. So just tape it on, take that out, and you're pretty much done. So this is going to be a very short video, and uh, you can even put this one inside this one to make a longer one. But uh, anyways, uh, so you can take your dart that I will make right now out of a piece of this. It can be anything. If you don't have these, you can just tape it on, obviously. And uh, I'm not even gonna use this big piece of paper. I'm gonna fold it in half and uh, save it for later. So you can make quite a few darts out of one piece of sticky note. So, I think four is the most you can make, but uh, that's still quite a lot. And, uh, once you have that, oh, sticky notes are really hard to rip, but they're not that difficult. As you can see, I got half, and you can just rip that in half as well. So one of these tiny squares will basically be enough to just make one dart. And uh, once you have that, you can rip it off and it'll just be like a square. And uh, now you can just fold it just so... Put it at a certain angle, like sideways, like a triangle, but leave, like, make it so that it's kind of sharp, 
but not that sharp at the same time. If you don't know what I mean, then just basically copy what I'm doing. Just roll it back, roll it up, take a tiny bit of tape. Right. Just that tiny bit would be good. And uh, just tape the tip of the dart and uh, don't need to tape the whole thing unless you want it to actually hurt somebody. Obviously, this might hurt a bit, but uh, it's not as bad. And as you can see, this won't fit because it's too big. So I'm just going to take a scissors, just cut the top part off just like that. So you should be left with this cone thing. It looks big, but if I just put it away and compare it to my hand, it's just that tiny. So put it in, and uh, if it stays in, then it will work. And uh, and as you can see, it has quite a lot of power, and uh, it might hurt if you hit somebody in the eye. So watch out for that. And if the dart's too small, don't worry. Just, uh, if, like, I will make one right now, make a random one, pretend, uh, a dart will be too small for this thing, hold on, so pretend a dart will be too small for this thing, then you can just basically pinch down on the two sides, and squish towards the center so you should get this formation like that and uh it'll work now obviously it's not gonna work it's a very tiny piece of paper but uh like that that's like a perfect fit so and it has and it's very easy to blow so yeah that's today's video and uh like subscribe comment down below what you want me to make and uh goodbye oh and last thing oh and last thing before you leave just comment down below what you think i should do with all of these darts that is actually useless i have way too much of this stuff so comment down below what you want me to do with all of the things that i've made so far because i have no idea what to do with them should i like burn them should i like throw them in the trash should i do something with them but uh other than that enjoy your day and goodbye